Miss Eyre? You've grown up into such a lady. Who'd ever have thought it? Don't start me off. Your cousin John is dead. And your aunt is taken badly. It's nearly a hundred miles away, Jane. I'm sorry, but that is where my aunt lives and she's been asking for me. Very well. You may go. But I want you back in a week, not a day longer, do you hear? Seven days, and if you're not back then, I'll come and fetch you. Thank you, sir. Edward? I've been outmaneuvered, my dear Blanche. Game's over. I thought you might explain the concept of the 28-day week to me. I'm sorry, but things weren't quite as straightforward as I'd hoped. Really? I had to help my cousins with my aunt's funeral arrangements. Oh, never mind me. Who am I to worry about? I had thought that you could deduct the money from my salary. So you have given me some thought. Thank you very much. Yes. Good. I'm sorry about your aunt. Not one single letter did you send me. Mrs. Fairfax had a letter. Adele and Sophie had a letter. No doubt even Pilot had a letter. But, oh no, not me. That was too much to ask. The whole of Thornfield was chattering with news of your return. But I, the master of the house, had to learn from Mrs. Fairfax that you were due home today. I've already been up at the village twice to see if the coach had arrived. I see at long last I've found something to make you laugh. I am so pleased my distress amuses you. It is not your distress that amuses me, sir. It is the thought of writing to Pilot. I can assure you, I did not send Pilot a letter. I'm sorry I did not write to you, but I thought you would be preoccupied with other things. Oh, did you now? Yes. Michel! 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 Welcome home, my dear. I missed you. Oh, oh she you. did. It's been so boring here without you. Mm. Sure not with all the other nice ladies and gentlemen here to entertain you. So you went the day after you'd gone. Jane. Yes. Will you walk with me? Oh, she must unpack. She want to get her things hung up. It's such a lovely evening. Well, there's a storm brewing up, I think. Perhaps just a little stroll then. I'll get your bag. <laughs> <laughs> 